Aloha. About a year ago, I was lucky enough to attend the DJI Aerial Photography Academy one-day course that Randy J. Braun and Stacy Garlington host. This year, I returned. I wanted to see how the course evolved, and I wanted to do a little review. There are professional photographers that are going to pass along some very good tips. Whether you're a 107 licensed pilot that's in their own, has their own business or plans on starting one, or if you're just like me, a hobbyist. However, I do have a 107 license, but I always fly as a hobbyist. During the course, you'll learn how to properly set up your DJI drone camera in the Go app, how to frame the subject when you're out on the field, and at the end, how to edit the picture so your pictures pop. Also, I want to mention a couple days before the course, you'll receive an email with a link to a whole bunch of pictures that they're going to use during the course. You want to download that and have those pictures on your laptop also, along with Adobe Lightroom Classic. During the course, you're going to get a nice workbook. It's yours free to take home. It covers everything that they covered in the class, so you can kind of refer to it again. Or when you're editing your pictures, you can go back through, kind of follow along with them to help your pictures pop. Other subjects that they cover are going to be things like LANK, the unlock system that we're going to be able to use as 107 pilots to unlock in certain restricted areas. Um, it goes by altitude and it's a grid pattern around like airports or whatnot. So you might be restricted to an altitude of 100 feet uh, or 200 feet or something like that. And so you can unlock it that way. Um, Verifly, on-demand insurance uh, that you can get when you're out on the site. At this point, I'd like to thank Randy and Stacy for allowing me to come back this year to check out the course. It's evolved very well. Uh, it's a good course, and I highly recommend it. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day. Bye.